Welcome to GeoGuessr. We have a Halloween theme going on uh, this week and for the month of October. We have the Strange Lands crew with Alzarath. Hello. The Pastafarian. Greetings. And Frankenstein's monster himself, Talkus. Yeah. That was the best impression of Frankenstein's monster I yep. ever heard. It was pretty good, yeah. <laughs> so anyways, uh, as you guys know, throughout the month of October, we'll be posting these custom-made challenges by viewers. Halloween-themed is, is the way we're going, and I think we have five Fridays in October, so there'll be five, perhaps even more than five, challenges. Uh, this one is submitted by Outstanding Gamer. Where was it submitted, Al? Do you remember? Uh, it was submitted on my channel. There you go. Submitted by Outstanding Gamer. Thank you very much, sir. Halloween themed, scary themed, whatever. I don't know. Anything that's supposed to be terrifying. My face? Yep. 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 Okay. Link will be in the description if you guys would like to play uh, uh, along with us. Uh, share your scores. We'd like to see how you did. And is everyone ready? I am ready. I, oddly enough, I am not. I am sending up my timer. Two <laughs> minutes. What about the Tolka monster? Is Tolka ready? Uh, you're mean about UHC, and I don't like you. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> He's ready. He's salty. All right, timer is set up. All right, ready? One, two, three, go. That's a reverse countdown. Uh, yeah. So, look at that. Um, Netherworld, Haunted House, okay. Um, yeah, they they kept seeing mean things about, like, so the UHC, and that makes me sad, because I love UHC. Actually, I should have this open. Um, I, I love UHC, man. But why, don't, why don't they love UHC like I love UHC? They always say mean things about UHC. Makes me so sad. Um, another thing. Graves Road. Ooh. Uh, I have no idea where this is, yeah. Um, yeah, this can, I can talk about the UHC, because this is going out after UHC happens. Which is cool, I guess. How do I just go along here, I suppose? I don't know. What am I supposed to be doing? Uh, Jimmy Carter? That's not helpful. Um, guys, I don't know what this is. I'll we'll put down in... Try to go back along here. Georgia. Okay, well, I guess we'll go... Georgia Southern, so I'll go with Southern Georgia, I suppose. Um, anything here? That, no, there's no, no nothing there that helps me. Any Jimmy Carters? Pennsylvania... Pleasant Dale Road? 2285. Is there a 285 anywhere? Or is there a 285? 285. Come on, 285. Uh, 285, people... Um... Guys, guys, yeah, I, I got nothing. Um, I two eight five. Um, I two eight five. I guess this suggests to me that, in fact, need. I'll go look at this sign here, and it's like. Right, time's up. Make a guess. Where is that stupid road? You were looking for 140 also, weren't you? Yeah, it shares ah. it shares a, a highway with 80 with the uh, interstate. The, the Jimmy Carter Boulevard. Um, yeah, it crosses the 85. Is it? Uh, is if it... you scroll a little bit north, uh, it's left from the 13. Oh, there it is. It's yeah, it's the Jimmy that... Carter Boulevard. Yeah, it looks like a larger expressway than uh, than it uh, shows on the map. I was ah, just looking okay. for 140. Yeah, that's what I was doing too. So, um, we start, you know, looking pretty much at Red Hat, Georgia, and um, I couldn't find 140, so I just guessed by Atlanta, got 4,987. How'd you do, Al? I guessed on the southwestern part of Atlanta, so just like exact opposite of this crap. So I got 4,403. Pasta? I guessed on the 400, uh, right at the junction to the Interstate 285. So I got 5,573. Nice. Focus. I saw a truck that said Southern Georgia on it, so I guessed Southern Georgia and got 2628. Alrighty then. 
But we, we came in pointing at a sign that said Georgia, so we. It's yeah, like, yeah, it was Georgia. pretty straightforward. I, I but, did not um, see. I did not see that sign. Uh, from from which movie would this location be then? It is. A, it, it was. It was by a horror. Halloween store. Ah, uh, okay. I didn't see that. <laughs> right. Kind of like a haunted house thing. Was Neither were. Ah, uh, yeah. right. All right, round two. Everybody ready? Yes. I'm ready. ready. Three, two, one, go. Let's see, what sort of haunted places are there in Indiana? There's American Flag. Um, open for tours. Eastern State. Well, I guess we're thinking somewhere in the east, I suppose. Um, what flag is that? Am I supposed to know what flag that is? I have no idea. Um, it ain't the Indiana flag, though, that's for sure. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I suppose this... If this this looks like it might be an actual fort, which means that, like, if it's an actual fort, then that's, like, colonial days. Um, Fairmont. Countdown. I don't know what this is. I'm, I don't know. I don't know, man. Guys, 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 help. Help pulls. Um, Ace Hardware. Oh, there's an Ace Hardware in Indianapolis. Near my house. Um, Fairmont. I feel like I've heard the name Fairmont, and I should know where it is. But I don't. Um, um, because I'm putting a preliminary guess down, like Virginia. So I'll look around for Fairmont, I guess. Um, Fairmont, 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 Fairmont. Um, Good fair. Until I see Fairmont. What if I do? Am I, am I insane? Oh, there's Winston Salem, I guess. Something. No. I, got, I ain't got no, no Fairmonts. I've heard that name before, man. Somewhere. But. Uh. No. I'm just going long. Just click clicking. Just keep clicking. Just keep clicking. Only. It's, you say Fairmont, but you don't say state name. Can you like state? So I can find you. Don't you want to be found? Oh, Fairmont. Why, why no be found? Uh, yeah, I'm just going down, I guess. Um, now we're in the, yeah, this market delivery and stuff. Just, just come, come to me, Fairmont. Come to me. Polish. Maybe I should get Poland. Um, uh, I saw a sign that looks like what, something that Indiana has, but this is not Indiana. Maybe this was Indiana. No, this is not, not, no. There is no place in Indiana that could be this. Um, All right, time's up. Make a guess. That. Actually, the, I, I messed up on the timer, so I just gave it a, a minute once I realized I, I messed up. Oh, all right. Um, so, I don't know. We were obviously in front of some kind of historical um, prison. I, I don't know what Eastern State Penitentiary is used in. Um. But it definitely looked like New England. I guess Boston got 2506. But uh, how'd you do, Al? I got a little bit lucky. <laughs> um, I was like, it looks like East Coast. And then I was like, maybe the buildings looked very distinct. It wasn't like a normal Eastern city. It's one of those that has a very specific look to it. But I couldn't remember which city it was that looks like that. So I guessed in New Jersey. Yeah, New Jersey. And I got forty-one sixty-four. Uh, pasta. I even got luckier because I went down the road and found the Philadelphia Museum of Art. So I plucked it in Philadelphia and tried to find uh, the prison. Couldn't find it. Got six thousand two hundred seventy points. Nice, Tarkus. Um, I thought we were in a place called Fairmont because I kept seeing signs for Fairmont everywhere. So I didn't know where Fairmont was, so I guessed Virginia and got 2554. Well, when you have large um, suburban areas like that, it, it can, it'll can it have a, like a, an area name, even though it's still within the city limits of Philadelphia. Well, you didn't got that in Indianapolis. Indianapolis is pretty small. No, it's the 11th largest <laughs> city in the United States of America, and it has a million people, and if you had a million people dogpiling on you, then it would be crushed into two dimensions, and you are mean. So and we have a cool is, flag. The question is, 
Is this from a movie or is this just um, an old haunted have you looked penitentiary? At the uh, at the prison itself, there were two gargoyles on top of the entrance. Right. And there was, I think, one of the vans that was there was like a haunted house kind of thing too. Well, there was like yeah, a bus. something terror of I don't right. know. Yeah. But still, I, I I don't know if that's just like a haunted thing, like a, a just a typical haunted house and haunted penitentiary thing, or if there was. Far, a... it doesn't seem like there's a movie tie in here. There's a wing. Yeah. If you zoom in, you can actually read the wings. Ooh. And one of them says the 1945 Tunnel Escape and Archaeology. So my guess is this is possibly a famous escape. And there is something Pep the Dog. What? what? Uh, in the middle. <laughs> yeah, below I the see. museum symbol. Pep, Pep the Dog. I have no idea what that is. Yep. I don't even want to know. Anyway. <laughs> Anyways, on the next round, you guys ready? Yes. Ready? Three, I'm two, ready, one. Er. Three, two, one, go. Ooh, there's a cool little park thing here. I'm gonna. Okay, let's go. Um, Golden Gate. I guess that's a clue. Um, okay, it's San Francisco, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, ah, so the, which gate is the Golden Gate? That's Golden Gate. Is this Golden Gate? Golden Gate. So this is Golden Gate. That's there. We're looking at it like like it's here. Maybe we're like here or something. So we're Golden Gate. Uh, Alcatrazes. Hi, Alcatraz. Where's Alcatraz? That's Angel Island. That's Alcatraz. Something's Alcatraz. The Rock. Um. Um, uh, making a grocery shop in, um, yeah, I have no idea, um, what any of this is, uh, so let's, let's, oh, this is on, oh, this is Al, this is on Al, oh, well, that's, um, this is on Alcatraz, I had not realized that this was Alcatraz itself, but that, that is a clue, um, where is Alcatraz then, um, I, I, I saw the, uh, the rock, the thing. Fort McDowell, I guess. Is that this thing? Look, is that this? This looks like a fort. Am I insane? Looks like I'm insane. Um. Look at Toronto's man. That's Red Rock. Uh, yeah, this, uh. I, I saw the, the, the rock with the. So. Maybe. I have like no idea. Like here, I don't know. Um, cause, like this could be the battery. All right, and time's up. I don't even know. Um, I got confused for a brief moment there, cause I, I knew it was in the um, in the Bay Area, and I'm looking around. I'm like, I can't find it. I can't find it. Where the hell is it? And apparently, I just wasn't zoomed in enough. Um, but eventually, I, I zoomed in and, and got it. Um, Alcatraz Island, 64-67. How'd you do, Al? 64-60. I guessed on the laundry building. I thought that was on the coast, but the marker for supposedly where it is is, like, right in the middle of the island. So I don't think it's exactly accurate. Probably not. Pasta? I think it is rather accurate because um, the, the plate where you can read stuff, uh, which is how I actually got that we are in San Francisco and Alcatraz, um... The cell block is right behind you, and you are looking to uh, to the ferry terminal and the guardhouse. So I think it's quite accurate. Uh, by the way, I have six thousand four hundred seventy-one points. Nice, Focus. Um, yeah, for whatever reason, I I knew we were on Alcatraz, which is uh, from The Rock, starring Nicolas Cage and Sean Connery that I have seen. Um, but I did not. Uh, I just couldn't see. I. I I, I guess I wasn't zoomed in far enough. I, I didn't see Alcatraz. I was just I didn't see. I, I was blind, man. So I guessed on Angel Island State Park, being very confused, and got six one seven six. I found it hard to click on Alcatraz. I had to zoom in far just to get on the island. Right, because you were. I, I did that too because I was I was clicking on the little the info icon. Button. Yeah. Yeah. But I did that too though because I was like, it's not on Angel Island. And I, I, I got for a second there, I'm like, oh wait a minute, is Alcatraz on a differently named island? I'm like. Oh no, I just didn't. I did that too. 
Um, I need to point out a little tidbit of information that we're all going to hate. Okay. Most of us got a higher score on this one guess than we got on all of Wednesdays. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> but it was in a different mode. Yes. All right. You guys ready for the next round? Yes. Ready. I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. Also, I, I think that bridge that I was looking at to try to be the Golden Gate Bridge was not, in fact, the Golden Gate Bridge. So, yeah, silly me. St. George's. Um, still look haunted. Do you think this is haunted? I don't think this is haunted. Um, Delaware City. Um, presumably Delaware City's in Delaware? I don't know. Uh, am, am I correct in thinking this? That, that Delaware City would be in Delaware? Am I insane? No, 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 no Delaware City. Delaware? No? I mean, it has to be somewhere around Delaware or something. Man, Delaware is a tiny... Tiny, 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 tiny little thing. Uh, no. Delaware City? No, no. Oh, well. Um, North St. George's. This is 99. And Wilmington and Philadelphia, and Philadelphia's there, and the ninety-nine, no, the ninety-five rather is here. The somewhere goes along Delaware City. Um, north to ninety-five that goes. I am confused. Um, what's this sign? Alt North. So it's somewhere along the ninety-five, and Philadelphia's there. There's, oh, the Delaware River, so maybe it's like... Uh... Fulof is here, we just go along, go along, we look for Delaware City or something. Or I don't even know, they probably, there's some, probably some clue I'm missing on this one, but... I don't know. Heaven, yes. I guess I'll guess the part of it that's in Delaware or something. Yeah. Yeah, be like there. And then I'll just keep going, I suppose. Yeah, nothing right, else. time's up, make a guess. Oh, yeah. I was a bit off. I was a little bit off, too. I I, I see what I did wrong, though, now. I didn't yeah. then. I was. I didn't think... I thought we were on 896 and not 13, and, and I, it didn't make sense because 896 looks small, but... Anyways, um, there are signs for Philadelphia, and... And you saw the Highway 1 sign, the Highway 95 sign. All points down to the south end there. I got 6201. What'd you do, Al? 3506, because all I saw was Wilmington, Philadelphia. And I, for some reason, did not see Wilmington, like, on the map. I, it's big. I just didn't see it. <laughs> I was flaking out. So, yeah, 3506. Pasta? I found a sign saying Delaware City and St. George's and then the 896, so 6151. And Tuggis. I Delaware City, I could not find. I was looking all over for the Delaware City. Now I see it is on the coast. Not sure how it I missed tiny. it. It's tiny. Yeah, but I didn't see it either. Yeah, I guess it's there. Uh, Hi, Delaware City. But we aren't near Delaware City. I don't even know. I just saw the 95 and guessed along the part of the 95 that was in Delaware. That's 5419. All right, I think we got one more. Yep. Yep, one more. Three, two, one, go. Um... Ooh, look at that. So this is a... Man, man, okay, so... So... So, um... So... Um, guys... Frederick? Gorg Frederick? Oh, this might... Be, yeah, this is probably like... Gorg Frederick. That looks like a German sort of name, and that, I'm not sure what this means, I'm not sure what this means, just, just going along, going along, I'm trying, to, trying to, to, to decipher the language on these tombstones, I guess, I don't know what this means, am I insane, I look I'm insane, um, so the name is Roar, Bavre. And Weirta said that A.E., um, or rather, ah, uh, said that A.E. 
means uh, Norway or Denmark. So, and there's like red houses and stuff, which suggests Norway. So I guess I guess Norway or something. I don't know. Yeah, I guess guess Norway. Yeah, guess like Christ Christensand. This looks like the sort of place you might find in Christensand. Because yeah, on, on the door here we have like this like General Gorg Friedrich Brugge. Bravil. Is there anything here that ends in Vil? I look like Vil. V I L L E. How would Norway end in Vil? I don't even know. It's a pretty place though. But I'll give it that. Uh, this looks, yeah, very, very pretty. A lot like Scotland actually. Um, so I don't think this is Scotland. Could be wrong. This could be Scotland. This could be England. This could be Germany. This could be America. This could All right, be. Alright, time's up. Make a guess. North, uh, northeast. I don't even know, but oh well. Oh come on. <laughs> Just all U.S. things and then just blank. Yeah. So, I don't know. I, I couldn't think of... I couldn't find anything significant about this other than it being a graveyard. I'm trying to picture some kind of movie it was in or, or any kind of significance. It was from a movie. Was I've it? seen it in a movie. They come out that gate and they turn right on it or walking down the street. It's two guys. I just can't remember what movie it was. Really? Mm-hmm. And I'm, I don't think it was a horror movie that I saw it in, but it probably was featured in a horror movie too. I was just gonna say I, I've I've seen my fair share of of Scandinavian horror films, and it I was an it, American film that I saw it on. Uh, so I, I figured, you know, there there's possibly no significance. This this person possibly is from Pennsylvania, so that's why we had um, guesses from Pennsylvania. So I'm like I'm plucking it in Philadelphia because I could see this kind of graveyard being in the middle of a, of a large city somewhere so i guess philadelphia got 1289 how'd you do Al? i guess pennsylvania as well and got 1283 <laughs> uh pasta i guess massachusetts although i could read a sign at the church entrance which said georg frederick um i thought it looked a bit northernish or eastern european but uh because of the house in the background um that looked like a east or northeast uh coast u.s style house so is it I an guess... asylum or, or that red building? no no uh the the red and white house um yeah the, in the red background building. um that looked like uh i don't know a school building or something yeah, like that. that's what i was thinking and uh, it had to be a catholic church I think. Um, guessing well, from it was how definitely it's built. Christian, yeah. Yeah, definitely Christian. So, Massachusetts, 1361 points. Uh, Tuckus. Why won't any... I think that some people should start uh, guessing uh, Catholic temples. But, yeah. um, yes, the name of the person who made took the picture had an A in it. It had an A-E, sort of like joiny thingy in it. And um, oh, on a, yeah. in the comments of a previous video, um, uh, said that AE meant Norway. And so I guessed Norway and got 2367. Nice. See, I didn't put any weight into the name at all. I don't know. I just didn't feel it was significant in this type of a well, Is, is AE a common American thing? No. Well, it, it, but it could be a tourist from uh, the northern yeah, states. Yeah, there's, there's lots of different US. names in America. Yeah, but it's best we had to go on and like I, I thought it looked like it might have been German because like there was like the Frederick name. There's like red house in the background and red is like the national color of Norway. Uh, apparently, Frederick is a name more used used in the um, the Scandinavian states. Well, you see, th there you go. Norway there you go. You see, you see, you see. I, I, I'm smart. And you are, you are bad. But there was a Carl there too. There were I don't know. There were just regular English names. Uh, Carl is uh, an old German name. Well, it's it's used in the U.S. as well. Yeah, with a seed though. Well, <laughs> I, yes. I think I was right, and you were wrong. So there. Yep, you were right. And I think that this right. is because you say mean things about <laughs> UHC that this happens to you. It's karma, potato, man. Please. You insult. <laughs> he potatoed himself. What? Did he? I don't know. I yeah, think Fixer did. did it. Oh, okay. no, no one he did it. He did it himself. himself. All right. Wow. Final That's score. I got twenty-one thousand four hundred and fifty. How'd you do, Al? I think I'm in last place with nineteen eight one six. Pasta. Twenty-five eight two six. Nice. And Tuckus. Tuckus. Pull the potato out. One nine one four four. So. 
Yay! I won. Passes are again our champion. Apologies for twice background this noise. Week. You can hear what's Although going on. Our, uh, our first appearance was <laughs> pathetic, but oh well. Winner. I am. I am last both seeds today. Ah, you had bad luck. That's all. I had a token so pole. is our first champion of the October challenges. Um, we're going to have more coming out every Friday, and perhaps even the last week of October, we might put out more than one. We'll see. We're not sure yet. But uh, thanks for the submission, Outstanding Gamer. Uh, we appreciate it. Um, and let us know if there's anything we missed uh, as far as the significance in the choices you made and any kind of um, information you can provide. That'd be fun to know. But uh, anyways... Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next week. See you guys next time. Bye. Goodbye.